guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Shantae's Wet here today. And today, you guys see my hair is soaking wet. I'm gonna be showing you guys my conditioning routine. Um, I think that conditioning is super important to the hair. I've always spoke about conditioning on my channel, mostly deep conditioning, but today we're gonna be focusing on regular conditioning and leave-in conditioner because that is just as important. And I'm gonna show you guys how I work it into my routine and all the details of why it's important to keep your hair nice and conditioned. And today I'm actually going to be using my product. This is a new product. This is the Angelic Coco No Separation 2 in one conditioner with coconut milk and lavender so this is a new product that i have on the website added to the angelic cocoa line if you guys have been following um this whole little <laughs> journey of me having my products i have been doing a lot of behind the scenes stuff to make sure that um this line is like a1 and you guys have tried it and some of you have um, left reviews and said how much you loved it if you have not fallen the North Fresh Chante Instagram make sure that you follow I'll have the handle right here so that you guys can go ahead and head over to North Fresh Chante's Instagram so that you're not missing updates on the website we put the updates there first so yeah I have this here I told you guys about it in my live and I told you guys like a lot of details on it but let's go ahead and get into the video and I'm okay so I'm like I have water everywhere so kind of ignore that um, but I'm gonna go ahead and start with my hair I actually already shampooed and conditioned my hair, deep conditioned my hair in the shower and then I put on a little bit of this conditioner and I didn't really go into depth because I wanted to show you guys the actual detangling process here. Normally I would do the detangling process in the shower um, but I wanted to do it here to show you guys how good of a slip this conditioner has. I have my hair sectioned into two. So in order to make sure that all of my hair strands get the type of nutrients and attention that they need, I'm actually going to go ahead and split my hair into four sections. A conditioner is always supposed to make your hair more manageable and more softer so that you're able to actually manage your hair and detangle your hair easier. It's not so chaotic when you're actually doing your hair. So that's the number one thing your conditioner should be doing. Also, most conditioners are going to protect the hair from damage, depending on the type of ingredients that is in the conditioner. So this conditioner here that I'm using, the No Separation 2-in-1 conditioner, does have two different herbal teas infused into the actual conditioner, which is more gonna focus on the actual help in promoting hair growth and also focus on softening the hair based on the fact that those ingredients actually are geared towards that. Also it's very important to make sure that your hair is nice and moisturized so that your actual detangling process can be a lot better. So there is mango butter in this conditioner in order to actually achieve that nice moisturized look on the hair. Okay so I just went ahead and put the conditioner on my hair it feels so silky smooth going on so as you guys see i'm just literally parting my hair so do you guys see that like barely anything let me do it now with the dimming brush which is a more um harder brush it's i think a little more tougher than the newer brush on detangling brush so i'm gonna go ahead and put that on so that you guys can see the contrast up and the brush is still going through my hair pretty easily look at that I'm even getting to the middle of my hair and it's still doing the same thing <gasps> it's still doing the same thing so that looks amazing and I'm done with my detangling no I'm serious I'm gonna have to do this on the rise hair for those of you who are gonna be like, can you do it on the rise hair? I am gonna do it on the rise hair. Um, thank you guys so much for just always commenting, by the way, so grateful for you guys. And I will do it on the rise hair. So excited. 
you know what I just thought about something I'm gonna go ahead even though this is the conditioning routine I'm gonna go ahead and use this as a styler as well you can do this based on how your hair reacts to conditioners um, you can actually use it as a styler so since this is a two-in-one you can use it as a regular conditioner and you can also leave it leave it in and use it as like a leave-in conditioner and I don't normally like to style with leave-ins because it's just not enough for my hair but I'm gonna try to do it today so let's go ahead and put a little bit more I actually did too much but it's okay and I'm gonna go ahead and put that on that section and now it's really gliding through like if you guys are wondering there's a nice fruity smell to this conditioner and it's very light as always my um, I don't like really heavy products so now I'm gonna go ahead and put a gel on top of my hair because I am going to wear this as a wash and go and I don't do my wash and goes without putting a gel on it. I'm using the Angelic Cocoa Clear Coarse Jelly um, with aloe and rosemary in it which is also going to promote hair growth as well. So I'm just going to put that all on that section and then I'm just going to move on to the next section. Alright, so I told you guys that I wanted to kind of test out and see if I can run my hands through here. Now I do have a little bit of the... Oh my god. <laughs> I do have a little bit of the conditioner on, um, but yeah, no. Okay, so you guys see how tangled my hair is that I'm not like just saying things. So let's try again. And it's getting caught. So let's go ahead and put some of the, um, some more of the two-in-one on and actually detangle the hair. Make sure that you do this on wet hair. It's not good to um, detangle your hair when it's super dry. The difference between doing a actual leave-in and actually washing it out is the fact that you're leaving it on your hair. So your hair is actually um, benefiting a lot from the moisturizing properties that are already in the conditioner and it's actually just being left on your hair. Just actually helping your hair to absorb a lot of the nutrients that are already in the conditioner of course you do absorb the nutrients with using it as a regular conditioner but actually leaving it on your hair is just 10 times more effective so it's amazing when you can actually have a leave-in in a regular conditioner because you can kind of choose which you want to do okay so I just went ahead and detangled the front of my hair I don't want this to be too flat the dimming brush sometimes is known to kind of like flatten out the top of the hair so I'm just gonna go back and break my hair and also individually curl some of the curls like in the front area I'm taking a little bit of the gel as well and I'm gonna put that on the pieces that I kind of curled And the right residue that's on my hair, it won't be there when it dries. So. My other side has gotten a little dry, so I'm kind of like nervous about that. Hopefully it doesn't affect anything, but I don't have my spray bottle in here and I don't feel like enough to get it. So, But we're just going to do the exact same thing, section the hair into two sections. This side is more tangled than the other side, so interested to see how this is going to go. So if you guys are wondering, I do suggest that you condition your hair every time you wash. So every time you wash your hair, you should definitely be putting a conditioner on. Um, it helps with moisturizing the hair and it also helps for um, making sure that your hair is actually reaping the benefits of your wash day. A lot of times if you're not using a conditioner on wash day, it can be the reason why your hair can feel very dry. And if you're using a very drying conditioner that only lasts about you know, the moisture only lasts about half that day. Um, that could be the reason as well. Or that just doesn't really work for natural textures. One thing about this conditioner is it softens your hair and your hair just feels extra soft. So on a normal day, um, if I was actually just conditioning my hair and not actually doing like a leave-in routine, I would actually just do this under the water and detangle my hair underneath the water. 
If you want to work this conditioner into the scalp, I encourage you to do so. It does have neem oil in here, which is amazing for um, promoting healthy scalp. So if you want to go ahead and like do a light scalp massage on your hair to actually make sure that the conditioner is actually getting on your scalp as well. There's a lot of exotic herbs in here such as sea back thorn, which is amazing for hair growth. So sea back thorn berry. I'm gonna make sure that I put the conditioner on my ends. So I'm finished with the whole conditioning process and my hair is now styled. I wasn't planning on actually styling my hair with the conditioner. So this is actually just something that I added to the video after, you know, I told you guys that I wanted to add it. So we're going to see how this turns out. Like I said, I normally like to put another styler on top of my leave-ins, but we're going to see how this turns out. I'm going to allow my hair to dry. Uh, I'm going to air dry and then I'm going to come back and show you guys. A few hours since I last was on here. I would say three hours since I last was on here. So it took my hair about three hours to dry and it's fully dry. So this is the finished product of me doing my conditioner routine. I don't have much of a hold on my hair because you know I don't want my hair to be too way down. So I didn't put a lot of gel. I just put a little bit of gel to define the curls. So I wanted to mention that on day two, my hair is going to expand a little bit and then day three is gonna really expand. Um, so this is just the first day of my hair. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and hopefully you guys are able to pick up the Angelic Coco line or any products from the North Chante website. And I'll have everything linked down in the description box for you guys so that you're able to just click the link. So go ahead and look down in the description box. Click down in the description box so that you're able to get everything. I hope that you guys enjoy this video. If it was helpful to you, please give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my Instagram at Shantae's Way and also Nourish by Shantae's Instagram at Nourish by Shantae on Instagram. Um, did I say subscribe? Don't forget to follow me on Instagram <laughs> and follow the Norris by Shante account as well. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel um, so that you do not miss another video. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.